Um, now let's get into the topic of um, privacy. So with regards to your service, there are multiple different ways in which the user can nominate for you to contact them to verify a transaction. Mm -hmm. uh, you, why don't you just go through those for us? Yeah. So the issue for us is we want to make sure that we can talk to the human instead of the wallet to verify a risky transaction. But we're extremely sensitive to um, the user may be very protective of their privacy. And we don't want Bitcoin to become less private just because they're using our service. So we offer the user the option of providing us with a phone number, an email address, or taking an OTP. And all of those fields are optional. So if the user only wants to use Google Authenticator, they're not, re they're not releasing any information to us about who they are. Or if they want email, then they're just giving us the email address, which can be a throwaway email address, does not have to be linked to their identity. Or if they want the added convenience of being able to be called when there's a transaction, then they can give us their phone number, which is obviously a little bit more revealing. But the goal is all fields that reveal something about the user are optional. The user gets to choose how much of their privacy they give us.